The modeled 1917 rifle may be loaded from a clip or without the use of a clip. To load from a clip into the magazine, draw the bolt fully to the rear. Place either end of a loaded clip in its slot on the receiver. With the fingers of the right hand under the rifle, against the floor plate, and the ball of the thumb on the powder space on the top of the cartridge near the clip, press the cartridge straight down with the thumb into the magazine with a firm, steady push until the top cartridge is caught by the right edge of the receiver. Remove the empty clip with the right hand. When cartridges have been started into the magazine, do not remove pressure on the top cartridge until the process of seating has been completed. If pressure from the thumb is removed, expansion of the magazine spring may force the clip from the clip slot and cause the clip to break when pressure is reapplied. To load the magazine without a clip, merely insert cartridges one at a time by pressing them into the magazine. After loading the magazine, feed a round into the chamber by closing the bolt, then place the rifle on safe. As the bolt is closed, the top cartridge in the magazine is pushed forward into the chamber. To load the rifle with seven rounds, place six rounds into the magazine and one round into the chamber. Press down on the top cartridge in the magazine as the bolt is closed so that the bolt will ride over the top of the round. When the rifle is used as a single loader, cartridges are inserted directly into the chamber with the hand, then the bolt is closed. If the bolt is drawn fully to the rear, the follower will have to be depressed to close the bolt. To unload the rifle, move the bolt forward and back without turning the bolt down until no cartridges remain in the magazine or chamber. The next film in the series will cover a detailed disassembly of the rifle. Thanks for watching. If you found this video interesting or helpful, Go ahead and give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. If you would like to support the channel, a link to our Patreon page is in the description. For more information on this firearm and others, head on over to historyandfirearms.com.